that they were doing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You don't even know what the, fucking planet you're on right now. I barely do. I uh, you barely know, do. How are you going to fucking make this happen? Uh, is this uh, the highest you've ever been already? It's, it's that thing. I, I haven't what taken any edibles in a while. It's four, th- it's four times my normal dose. This is it's like not a, just this because you guys take 25 times your normal dose. It doesn't lessen that it's way, way past what I would ever take to get super high. I get on a plane or I want to zonk out 50 milligrams. The girls at the dispensary think I'm weird because I buy so many goddamn like edibles. They think you're weird? <laughs> Why? Well, maybe I'm just paranoid, but I come in and I buy like a pack of 600 like three times a week. Oh, like, I, what do you do with these? <laughs> me and the fucking security guard on our first name basis. Yeah, yeah, Shout yeah. out to Eddie. What's up, Eddie? Yeah, he, he watches. He asked me. He asked me. He goes, I, Lee hasn't mm-hmm. been in for a few days. I said, that's good. I threw him a sack of fucking stars. He's at home right now. He, st- he built this. He's a soldier, this Lee Syed dog. He ain't got time to fuck around with Uncle Joe. The problem with the red ones, though, is I have to eat five of them to even feel so anything. What? Five, how much are the red ones? 125. You see five of those to feel anything. Well, worth feeling. What am I going to get a little high? No, I, I know. The, I get that. Yeah, I get the feeling. I get that. I get that. <laughs> But at six twenty five is your like well, yeah, I mean let's do it if we're gonna do it. That's that's what that is. You're pretty much now. <laughs> After four years of Yeah constant <laughs> marijuana training. Uh-huh. <laughs> like it's not like it's only a documentary either. Uh-huh. It's like you just wanna do it yeah, for yourself. Even a- You're like, I'll keep them around and see what happens. Do you think you get to a thousand? I've been to a thousand. You got, yeah, you've been to a thousand. You've uh-huh. crossed the four digits. Yeah. Damn. Oh, wow. <laughs> Pretty soon when I eat that whole 5,000 milligram star oh just God. in you one ever, show. Do you ever hear stuff that's not around? Apparently once during the show, but not before that. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you tormenting them on? No, I like it now. It's fun. <laughs> I think it'd be great just to own a dispensary. Yeah, we should. The first time you ate an edible, how many milligrams was it? Uh, you told me. I don't know. You used to change the guy. I used to ask because, you know, I hear all these things. And he like, who cares? Who knows? <laughs> they don't have, I don't know, I just eat it. So, I don't know, probably 50? No, no. When we first started, you were doing 50s and 35s. I had your light. Light. I, I had you it's the 30. biggest they make in Colorado. They don't even make them. That, I think they make <coughs> like ten. The first thing I ever gave you was the thirty fives. I used to split the thirty fives in half. Okay. And then I knew that they came in one eighty. After about a month or five weeks of thirty five, I said, "Fuck it." I took it like a weight regimen. For example, if you went to the YMCA tomorrow, today it's Monday, right? And you start lifting today. Right. Yeah. And you did like three weeks of fucking lifting. And after the fourth week on Monday, we start stacking the weights and see what you could lift. Yeah. And you lift, you know, 300 pounds, you know, whatever. But after that, we're going to cater the workout for that, too. So what I decided was, since I was his trainer and his godfather, mm-hmm. was I took the labels off the 180 and I cut them in half and put 35s around them. Sure. And I jumped them up from 35 milligrams straight up to 90. You understand? Jesus. <laughs> I had them there. Then I was giving them those 200 milligram cookies that were definitely 6,000 milligrams. They were definitely. Really? Going Just on. dosing? Oh, my God. I know So for you never give anybody the right amount? No, no, no. I didn't know for a fact. Listen. You go to the store and they tell, you, his beliefs. they tell you that these cookies we used to get, there were these circle cookies. Maybe it's because of the frosting. What, was they, what were they called? Remember they gave us a box and nice guys in San Diego. They were like this. They were 200 So kind? Mil- so kind. They oh, were yeah. 200 oh, milligrams. Ari, do you know how many fucking times me and Lee split a so kind cookie and Lee couldn't fucking talk, I couldn't talk? That's a lot more. Just than a so kind of cookie. Split it down the middle. Me and they have, they have like one. They one. Good fucked up. We get fucked up. What about the the whole brownie excursion we went to, when you gave the chick the lemon bread? No, the, the banana little, bread. No, you gave her the corner or something. The banana gave, bread. It was a banana yeah, bread. We were it was a banana to, bread. We've been in training for years. Oh my god! But I you, gave her so little. 
I gave her so little. We made an astronomical THC jump. Uh, because it was a banana bread. bread. That was a plague on the, on the <laughs> scene. People were getting a whiff of it, and it was just wrecking people. Any amount. It was delicious with the chocolate chips. We took it chips. to Six Flags. We took it to Six Flags. Yeah, it was delicious with the chocolate chips. That whole trip in New York, we were fucking cutting off slices to do the documentary. How about the ride home? The scare. Oh, the what? The scariest ride home. I was when you gave it to me in the morning. We all, almost missed our flight. Fucking unbelievable. At least doing 800 milligrams a THC off the bat talking to motherfuckers yeah well that's, that's, I, I honestly think that it's at a certain point the body's like hey you fed way too much so we're just gonna turn that off right now so I think I'm pretty much over fine. that over that threshold I think so no this is what you do yeah what a couple you do? weeks we take it back into training yeah we go back to 125 oh wait what just to one star for one that's not gonna do shit listen to for me for a while the body adapts I would take about three times. By the fourth time, you'll be fucked up at 120. That is a good thing about weed. It, your tolerance yeah, goes your right tolerance back down. Goes right back right down. Back down. I love coming back to LA. Whatever I do, it's one. like, what oh, it's great doing? for the first week or two. I got you in training, at least I am. I got you in training. But we never take breaks. Well, who takes a break? People don't take breaks. Do you think Nate Diaz takes a break? Do you think Nate Diaz takes a break? It's, come on, man. He's no, always boxing, he's shadow boxing, doing jumping jacks. Challenging the future. He's yeah. doing a yacht. Doing push-ups. That's what he said, but yeah. he was doing something. <laughs> he was like running. Believe he was make believe. Something. Only you he's trying. Him. He's out there trying every yeah. day. And he was he's getting his dick sucked and smoking weed and jumping up and down. But I guarantee that motherfucker was running 10 miles four times a week, three times a week. Around 209 a miles a week. And I do. How could he ever do anything He's else? He's got built-in cardio. He didn't go in there and look that smooth in the second round throwing all those punches. He did, though. Because he, he was in times. shape. He was in shape. If it's 2 in the afternoon and you ain't high, go fuck yourself. Get out of my face. I want you around me like I want cancer in my ball sack. You know what I'm saying? You're going to come around here looking at me with your fucking white eyes. Thinking that you know I'm gonna re- I'm gonna reform. Go fuck yourself. My morning starts at 5:30 a.m. Either you're there or you're square. You know what I'm saying?